Hello everybody, Dead Man's Macaroni here. Get your macaroni ready because this is part 7 of Fallout Shelter. Um, so I did a couple of things throughout today off screen. Um, I found the mysterious stranger a couple more times. We haven't quite found him six times yet, so the courier isn't quite ours. But soon enough. Soon enough. Um, so far I've been keeping up with a daily episode of this. Um, I don't know, I'd, sometimes I upload more than one episode. That's just because I recorded, like, three, so I've always had three on hand, you know? Um, but I uploaded a couple, a couple of them today, so, because I need to make some space. So let's bring her in, first of all. She's got a bunch of stuff. Um, we'll let her visit in here for a little bit. We need more energy, that's our problem. So yeah, I upgraded this room, I think. I don't remember if that was on screen or not. Uh, the diner is upgraded. I think it is, anyway. Alright, the room fully upgraded. Or maybe I did that on screen. I don't remember what I did. I did a few things, though. Um, I'm going to upgrade this room. Because power is what we always seem to be low on. Um, I think I'm finally understanding how the rush percentage works. Um, I'm pretty sure each time like it filled, the timer actually goes down and you collect it the normal way your percentage to actually succeed at rushing goes, uh, or your percentage to fail at it goes down. Um, 33. Oh, oh, that's mysterious stranger music. Where is he? Oh, oh, we just barely missed him. Because I saw him there. Dang it. Oh, well. I'm sure we'll see him again. So I'm going to try to rush this. Success. Alright, cool. Sometimes you just got to risk it. So everything is green, but it, everything is also fairly low green. It's because we have more people now. Oh yeah, that's another thing. There was also a couple of kids. One of them grew up already. And I believe I signed her right here. Yeah, Kelly King, and then the other one is probably still a kid, um, yeah, right there, Terry King, uh, I just let them have the names that they were, that they were just assigned right off the bat, because, I don't know. I have somebody named Joe Hansen, that's all I care about. Hmm. So I gave this person, these two people, um, enhanced shotguns now, so they're a lot more powerful. So if anything attacks, if more raiders attack, they're definitely going to be in for surprise. We need to get more food going. Um, that one's almost ready. This one, on the other hand, is not. So I'm not going to bother rushing it, because I think they can wait a little bit longer. That one would probably succeed, but it's, it's already fairly close. Actually, both of them would probably succeed, but they're already kind of close to being done. Um, hmm, let's send her back out into the wasteland. Give her some stim packs. I'll give her five. I'll give her three right away since we don't get as much of that. Hmm. Maybe she actually won't die this time. Thing is, I've had to revive her almost every time, but that's my fault for leaving the game alone so long. Hmm.
I'm always saying that when I'm recording this. Hmm, hmm. Ah, oh, that's gotta get old. Okay, I can do this. I hope so. I'm about to get more food. And more water. Which is exactly what we need. Hopefully no room shut down. Well, we're about to get... Oh, of course this one shuts down. I need to build a power generator right there. That's what I'm going to do. Hang on, hang on, actually. Should I do that? Or should I build a bigger water treatment center? Hmm. There I go again. Uh, I think it'd be smarter to make these rooms bigger, actually. Because we can always use more water treatment. Well... Hmm. God, that's a bad habit. Uh, should we rush this room? Most definitely not. Why would we rush a room that's almost done anyway? That one we can probably go ahead and rush. There we go. Success. Ooh, and we got caps. We have a decent amount of caps. We should probably do something with them after this one's good to go. Boom. Almost got our water. This one's almost done, and that one's a big one, so should be good. Man, the med bays take forever, but that makes sense. So do the science labs. Kinda. I actually upgraded the med bay. I think I did that on screen. I don't remember if I did it or not. But now it does three stim packs regardless each time, so. Um. Hmm. I really should make the diner bigger. Or wait, no, it wasn't a diner, it was a water treatment center. So that's exactly. Oh, wait, was this one already. Oh, that sucks. I thought you could make them three. You can, for some. But not all, apparently. Okay, we need more food. Yeah, let's go for it. Success. And then power. Any one of these power stations almost done? Uh, let's just go for it. Another success. Wow, we're we're being rather lucky on those. Oh, haha! I think if you find them early, the earlier you find them, the more caps you get. Cause I got like 400 caps out of them one time, if I remember right. We just have to find him one more time. I'm trying to check on her status. She got 25 caps. Whoa, I should have healed her before she went out there. Hmm. Well, she has enough stim packs and right away that she should be fine. She's almost level 10. Whatever, she dies, we'll revive her. Because she's our wasteland explorer. We probably should have more than one Wasteland Explorer, but with with this small of a vault, how many do you really need? Once this baby up here is born, we'll be able to have a radio, um, a radio room, and then we'll have more people. How close is this person to grow? Ooh, they're about to grow up. That'll be good. Hmm. Only at 50% happiness right now, though. I wonder why. Power's running low again. The power is always running low, though. That's the thing. How much would this one be? Yeah, let's go for it. I know we're risking it too much, but okay. Well, I knew that was bound to happen eventually.
diner. That's yeah, just a room on fire. It's no big deal. More rat away. Maybe we should give her something. I have all these outfits, but I'm not giving them to these people. Uh, she should take the Merc gear, probably. Yeah. Um, we'll give her the, hang on, let me see here. What is the room that she's in? Good for. That's intelligence. So, do we have anything that'll help her with intelligence? Exactly what I was going to give her, the junior officer uniform. Nice. You know what? Even though he doesn't really need it, I like Joe Hansen, so I'm going to give him a... Uh, a hunting rifle. Everyone else is as happy as I am. Well... You're in a Santa suit, so nobody's going to be as happy as you are, to be fair. It, 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 it only makes sense. We're running low on food and power again. What a surprise, we're running low on power. Yeah, I really should build another power generator. I mm, think I will. Only thing is, is that there's really, there's, I don't have anybody to assign to them yet. To gain access to the next, ah, oh, yes, and now we can build our next, the elevator leading to our next floor. There we go. Hmm. If only this kid would grow up. Where did the kid go? Hmm. Wait, why is the kid low on health, losing health? That makes no sense. Must have... That's right, they, they do lose health when you're low on food, I guess. Man, it's always something. If it's not... If you're not low on energy, then you're low on food. If you're not low on food, then you're low on water. At least both of these stations are kind of lined up with how they... Um with when they finish more power that's good that's good ooh even more power now let's go for it nice nice that extra power will be useful okay I really need to, to assign somebody to the power generator down there. Um, I really wish that kid would grow up. But, I think that with the building of that elevator and the power generator and everything's at green, so I think I'm going to have to end this episode here because I'm pretty much out of stuff to do. So I will see you guys next time for part 8 of Fallout Shelter. See you then.